Tensions are rising in one of the most hotly contested regions on the planet, the South China Sea. From militarized artificial islands to fighter jets and warplanes, China's heavy presence in the disputed region is putting the U.S. and its allies on notice. CNN got rare access aboard a U.S. Navy surveillance flight and saw firsthand some tense moments with China's military. Here's CNN's Ivan Watson. This is a close encounter with a Chinese warplane filmed just off the wing of a U.S. Navy reconnaissance plane flying over the South China Sea. We're getting a close-up look at a Chinese fighter jet. The air crew here identifies it as a J-11, a two-seater that they say is armed with air-to-air -air missiles. And it's been shadowing this U.S. Navy plane now for about 15 minutes. It is pretty remarkable to see this Chinese warplane operating at such close proximity, just several hundred feet away from our aircraft. The Chinese fighter escort, part of a regular routine. I'd say it's another Friday afternoon in the South China Sea. The U.S. Navy invited CNN to fly on a P-8 reconnaissance plane, taking off from a U.S. air base on the Japanese island of Okinawa. Along the way, picking up fuel from a flying gas station. We're refueling in midair right now, We're flying just about 40 feet away from a KC-135 tanker plane. The plane is headed past the self-governing island of Taiwan, which China claims as its own, to the South China Sea, which China also claims almost all for itself, ignoring competing claims from countries like Vietnam and the Philippines. Some 30 miles from the Chinese-occupied Paracel Islands, a Chinese voice crackles over the radio. American aircraft, this is the PLA Air Force. You are approaching Chinese airspace. Keep a safe distance or you will be intercepted. That's when the Chinese People's Liberation Army fighter jet appears, flying so close you can see the pilots in their cockpit. PLA fighter aircraft, this is U.S. Navy. I hold you off my left wing and I intend to continue to proceed to the west. The Chinese pilot never responds, but eventually leaves when the U.S. plane turns south. It's like oil spots as they build, as they build on one reef and then build on another. Commodore Will Torreson shows the network of man-made islands China built on what had been coral reefs claimed by other countries. Our number one focus here is to ensure that we have uh, continued access uh, alongside all of our allies and partners to international airspace and international waters. The U.S. presence here aimed at preventing further encroachment by China. Excellent, Charlie, copy, no worries. We're flying at a low altitude, a thousand feet, a little more than 300 meters above sea level, east of Taiwan, looking for a Chinese warship currently believed to be operating in these stormy waters. The plane spots a Chinese guided missile destroyer. U.S. aircraft, U.S. aircraft, this is Chinese Navy warship. You are approaching me. Keep safe distance away from me. Over. I'm a United States military aircraft and I will remain a safe distance from your unit. A cat and mouse game between two rival militaries in one of the most hotly contested regions in the world. Ivan Watson, CNN, over the South China Sea.